Hey everyone, Truthly Base here, and welcome back to Metroid Fusion. Last episode, hell started breaking loose, so let's find out what's going on. Emergency in Sector 3. Oh, gee. What gave you the clue? The area can melt down soon. It seems that the main boiler's cooling unit is malfunctioning. This could easily destroy the entire research station, as it would likely trigger the auto destruct explosive. Uh oh. We have about six minutes. Hurry to Sector 3 and access the control room to the side of the main boiler room. Most of the systems in Sector 3 are down because of this. Again, we know who to blame. The SAX must have packed into the control file. What impressive intelligence. Is your objective clear? Yes. There's a little time. Hurry to the control room in Sector 3. Okay, now we enter our first timed mission in the game. Move faster, elevator! These elevators are slow. Come on. Move faster! <laughs> Alright, come on, let's go. Just run and sh keep shooting. Try to see if I can get the shoot. Keep see if I can get it. Yes. Yes! Get your speed booster going and you can just run through, plow through there. Makes it a lot easier to get through there. A little nice trick for the... For that. Okay. We're gonna basically go back this way, like kind of like we went initially for the for, for the pursuit missile. Except this time we're gonna go, just jump down here. Take this room to the left. And, yep, superheated rooms on the way. Now you have to watch the lava for the rising flames like that because that could easily knock you into the lava from up there. Also, make sure, have your ice missiles ready to deal with those things up there. An ice missile and a normal shot will be enough to deal with them, thankfully. Seems kind of a bit of the opposite of the usual method, huh? Where it's like an ice beam and you one, 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 one missile. Oh well. That's Metro Prime, though, that I've seen it more, though. That, not, not as much as 2D games. Okay, come on. Six minutes re six minutes really is a generous amount of time for this. Oh, oh, come on! Ow! No, no, no! Get out! Get out of there! Get there! We go. Don't worry about damage you're taking right now, cause. If you've been following like me, you should have plenty of health. And, and right now, speed is more important right now. Freeze that because that platform is a bunch of fake blocks. Well, here's the main boiler. Look at that. It's having been two minutes and we're already here. But we got another one of these things here. And come on. Open, open the eye. I don't need those blasts right now. Open the eye. Come on. There we go. All right. What, now what's it? What are you doing? Whoa, Corex. Come on. There we go. Pretty simple. But it's another one of those beam Corexes, which means we get the wide beam ability. It, basically, the beam's beam's now stronger, and it's and we have a bit more of a range with it now. Well, hit that pad and cooling unit operational. <sighs> Whew. That was close. Ow. Well, now all we can do right now is just go back and is just go back and. I actually want to pick up a couple, there's actually a couple upgrades I want to pick up on the way back, so, oh, let's kill this thing first. Why can't I hit that? Oh, forget it. I'm not worried about the health, because one of the things I'm picking up is an energy tank. Now, technically, this stuff, you can wait, you can wait for it until we come back again later. Much later. Whoa, watch out. 
because you watch those little things in the in the lava, it gives you a hint as to what, as far as like where those little pillars of fire are going to be coming up. Well, can you call them pillars? Whatever they're called. First of all, let's go through this door here. Ow. That was just stupid of me. Plant a bomb, uh, uh, this square up here. And you please do a missile tank. But that, but that's not all we're here for. You're also going to want to plant another bomb here. Now, do not go through that door. It's going to be a dead end. Get your ice missile ready to freeze that. Use that as a platform to get up here. See, now we can uh, approach on the other side now. Now, be at this point you have to be careful. Those are fake platforms, so you're going to have to freeze each one of these things with your ice missiles. So that way you have a safe spot to land on and you get your energy tank up there. Plus, go back all the way around this way, you get yourself a missile tank too. Nice few upgrades to get on the way here. There is more, but we can't... But that involves going through lava and... And we're not quite ready to do that yet, so let's go ahead and start heading back. Now, quick way to get back up here, get all the way to the left here and shine spark up. Look at that! Look how quickly that was. Now let's... Actually, let's go on ahead up this way here, because, because I've never shown that part of the map yet, which... There really isn't much to it, I just don't, I just don't want to show it though. Use your missiles here. That way, still destroyed. I just wanted to show this way here, so this is show that you weren't really missing anything here. So, well, now we can go back to Adam now. Well, come on, let's get. I just wish there was a faster way up there. And I'm not worried about re recharging right now because we're good right now. We still got plenty of missiles. Saving, we just started, so... Alright, so, let's go. The X can move the crew member? It all makes sense now. The X can absorb the memories and knowledge of their prey. What an astounding find, HQ is very impressed. But don't you find it strange? This could have destroyed the station with the X in it, not to mention the SAX. Unusual for a self-preserving species that like the X, unless... Your presence is an even greater threat, a threat to the existence of X elsewhere. This is only a hypothesis. Perhaps their survival instinct is in conflict with the newly borrowed intelligence. Don't let your guard down yet. The X is still a threat. Samus, I see bio signs on the habitation deck. Survivors? The infected equipment you saw had survived until recently. Maybe there's a chance. The signs emanate from here. Yeah, let's go. I've just restored power to the main elevator. Use it to return and look for any survivors. Alright! We finally can get back up to the main deck! So let's go up there then. Alrighty. So please let there be survivors. I mean, with the no in the X, it's not likely. Come on, let's let's go take a look. We we still got some time for this episode, so let's go. Now there's also a couple things we can get up on the main deck too while we're here, so. So, for starters, I'm gonna get, go over this way, get your speed booster ready, run through here, and speed boost through this, through this way to get yourself a missile tank. Alright. Oops. Did not mean to do that. I, I messed that up. Well, okay then, let's. Now, before we go any further, let's check this area out here. Now, we couldn't go through here early because this is cold and we would have taken damage. Why is there ominous music here? What the? He's here? What would he be doing here, though? Well, enough about that. Let's go on ahead. Back. Let's get back. Let's get back to our task. Survivors. Come on, get get up there. Great way to Now I, I showed this thing earlier, but 
Nothing we have can damage it right now, so we're gonna have to come back later for that. Well, we got ourselves another elevator. No, up here. It's got a save room over here. Okay, now, now let the decks form. You're gonna need to get to let them use these things as platforms again, as we learned from over here. And uh, let's go on over here and oh, oh, how cute! It's those things from Super Metroid. Okay. That's good. So you have to use your speed booster that way. Now, before we go any further, get yourself a missile tank over here. There's nothing else over in this direction. So, this act, what, we, what we actually want to do is go through this part here. Oh, I messed that up. Okay, just, just use those as th guys as platforms there, and let's open them up. Lock disengaging gate opening. Oh look! Oh look at those little guys. Look at these blue. These. Uh, oh, look! This is really so cute. Oh. Uh, it's fortunate that they were not human though. So. It's like, those little guys are so cute. Come on, you can't tell me that they were not cute. Save room over here if you want to save up. I, I'm going to continue going for it because I still got a couple minutes. Alright. Itacoons and Dachoras. Dachoras? I've met these intelligent beings before. They seem to recognize me as well. How unusual to meet again here. In the past, they've helped me unleash abilities I didn't know I had. But where do they run to? I hope they're safe. Yes, those were the creatures b that helped Samus out with abilities like Super, and Super Metroid. In fact, the Dakoras, that, that shows how you pronounce it, actually helped demonstrate the Shine Spark ability. Welp, in any case, let's give Adam the news. So the survivors were not human. Most unfortunate. We cannot confirm the deaths of all crew members. I imagine this was the case, but I had hoped it wasn't so. I believe the X only infected the humans for knowledge. That form is, much, is too weak for battle. I'm sure the others were merely food for the X. I think they are evolving, growing stronger. Some are not appearing that resist your current weapons. I, yeah, yeah, we saw them. HQ anticipated this isn't powerbomb data as soon as the hardware team finished it. Oh, sweet! Yeah. Download it immediately. Our choice of data rooms is limited to this one in Sector 5. Go. Now. Alright, so... Looks like we're heading back over to Sector 5, so... There isn't anything else I'm picking up. There's not anything else I'm going to be picking up on the way there, so... I'm just going to meet you guys back in Sector 5. Alright, here we go. You've been to the state room before, but I'll show his position again. Alright. Is your objective clear? Yeah. Now move out! Well, we're going to have to do that next time, because we're out of time. So next time on Metroid Fusion, we'll be picking up the Powerbomb data, so see you guys next time.